Hello and welcome back to the Beerman Blog. Happy December 16th, the 16th day of our Aldi Hoppy Holidays Advent Beer Calendar for 2020. Today's beer is Seswins. I don't know how you pronounce that. Says Owens? Seswins? Seswins? I don't know. It is a Belgian blonde beer. And... It's got a very interesting looking label on it. Some guy dressed like a... Or the sun, I guess. I don't know. And then... I really don't know what that guy's wearing. I'm just going to say that's a raincoat. Take that as you will. But, yeah. I don't know. But apparently... The sun is giving the guy in the raincoat a beer, or maybe the other way around. I don't know. But, yeah, I really don't know what's going on on that label. But this is another Martins beer, Brewery Martins. It says Seswins. This is, oh, what is the alcohol content on this one? 6%. 6% alcohol for this blonde beer. It is a Belgian blonde beer. And, well, if everyone has theirs out ready to go, I actually am not prepared. I need to go get my bottle opener. So I will be running to get my bottle opener. Okay, got my bottle opener. There we go. So everyone who has their Sezwins ready to go on this December 16th, if you're following along, glad you're following along. Appreciate everyone following along. Give me a subscribe if you haven't already. Give me a like, all that good stuff. But let's go ahead and pop our Seswins open and see what we got going for what it looks like here. I'm really running out of ways to describe this sort of color. Just yellow and hay and straw. This one might have a little bit more of a, a yellowish-orange type of tint to it, maybe. But, it's a blonde. We'll just say that. It's blonde colored, just like it says. Belgian blonde. Let's go ahead and see what the aroma is. Hmm. I'm just getting malt. There's a citrus in there, maybe like a lemon, lemony type of citrus. Maybe some grass. Really, not much else about that one. Looking online here, I'm sure. Let's see. Sweet grain, malt, lemon lime. So yeah, that's, that's what I'm getting. But who cares how it looks? Who cares how it smells? How does it taste? So everyone following along here on December 16th, let's toast to December 16th and all drink our Seswin's Blonde Beer. So a toast to everyone, and let's go ahead in three, two, one. Okay, that one's got a little bite to it. I like that. Got a bit of a crispness to it, I think. Not too bitter, not too sweet. This one's probably a good all-rounder. I like this one. It just has that slight bitter bite to it, but it doesn't linger around. And yeah, I don't I don't think this one's that bad at all. Let's see what people are saying here. A sweet malt backbone, okay. Double dry hops, so that's probably why the hops are coming through pretty good. Um, some people are saying this is the hoppiest blonde they've had, or at least one person has said that anyway. Some people, just one person. Uh, someone says the bitterness is slightly astringent. Yeah, I I guess. I mean, it's got the malt and then the bitterness. 
I think this one's good. I like, I like it. That's good. It's a nice beer. I like that one. That is your Seswin's Blonde Beer. It is a Belgian, Belgian Blonde. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of this one. Uh, subscribe again if you haven't already. I do appreciate everyone who's following along. Hopefully everyone is having a good December 16th. And if you haven't already had a good December 16th, hopefully everyone will be enjoying if you haven't enjoyed your says wins already. And like I said, I appreciate everyone for watching. Until next time, while we head on down the 16th already. Wow. Man, we're just, time's just flying by. It's going to be Christmas before we know it. But anyway, thanks for following. Thanks for watching. And until next time, stay out of trouble.